Welcome, Superintendent Chalmers. Please come in. We were just about to start cooking the matzo ball soup. It won't be ready for a little bit yet, but please make yourself comfortable. Thank you, Principal Skinner. That's very kind of you. Would like something to drink while you wait. We have water, tea, and juice. I think I'll have some tea, please. Certainly. I'll make a pot right away. What have I done? This was supposed to be a nice meal to celebrate Passover, and now I've gone and ruined it. Is this punishment for my sins? Is this the universe's way of telling me something? I must have done something wrong. I will try to make it right. Please forgive me. May will try to make it right. Please forgive me, May. The gods grant me the strength and knowledge to make things right. Oh, great gods above. Please grant me the power to turn this burnt matzo ball into cress. I know this is a tall order, but I'm hoping you will help me. I need your help me. I need your help. With your will and power, anything is possible. I'm sure I can do this if I just have enough faith. Please give me a sign. Please give me a way to achieve my goal. Show me the way. Thank you for hearing me. I'm grateful for your help. Now let's see what I can do with what I have. What is going on in here? The kitchen is filled with smoke. What's happening? Oh, uh, nothing. Just cooking some delicious lunch. See? It's just steam from boiling water for pasta. I'm sure it'll clear up in no time. Steam? That doesn't explain why the fire alarm is going off. No more excuses. Tell me the truth. All right. The truth is the kitchen is on fire. I was trying to bake a cake and the oven caught on fire. I was trying to put the fire out, but it got a bit out of control. I'm sorry. What is this? This isn't matzo ball soup. Explain yourself. Uh, well... This is a special variety of matzo ball soup that is made with cress. It is an ancient recipe that has been passed down through the generations. This is a very rare and special treat. I just thought your students would appreciate something a little different today. But why didn't you tell me about this when you offered the soup? Well, I thought it would be a delightful surprise. I wanted to give your students something special and I thought this would do the trick. I'm sorry if I caused any confusion. Uh, this is unacceptable. You should have told me the truth in the first place. I expect honesty and integrity from you in the future. We have to get out. The kitchen is on fire. No, no. It's probably just the smoke detectors malfunctioning. I'll get an electrician right away to take a look at it. But the smoke is getting thicker and I can see the flames. We have to go now. No, I'm sure it's just a false alarm. I'll double. Check to make sure it's nothing serious. It is serious. Can't you see the flames? We need to evacuate immediately. Thanks for lunch, Skinner. It was great as always. I better be off now. Looks like your house is on fire. Oh, no. Please wait. I'll call the fire department. No need. I can hear the sirens already. You should get out of here and make sure everyone's safe. Yes, of course. Thank you for your help. I'll see you soon. Good luck.